Hi, this is Madhav Sankar. Hi, this is Akash Kumar Nujigeta. We are doing a new project work. That is infrared remote control circuit. The things which are required for this project are 230 volt to 6 volt step down transformer, 7805 voltage regulator, IR receiver, triple 5 IC, 7474 IC, BC187 transistor, IN4007 diode, two capacitors, one of 1 microfarad, another of 470 microfarad, two resistances, one of 220 kilo ohm, another of 100 ohm, and this is the 6 volt relay. First of all, we need a half wave bridge rectifier. The circuit diagram is shown on your screen. We are using a step down transformer from 230 volt input to 6 volt output. Then we are using 4, 4 I and 4007 diode and 6 volt DC output is taken. A capacitor of 470 microfarad is connected in parallel with it. A 7805 voltage regulator is connected with it and the output is taken out. The output from the bridge rectifier is pulsating DC. Therefore, we are using a capacitor as a filter which converts pulsating DC into pure DC waveform. And then we are using a 7805 voltage regulator the first pin of voltage regulator 7805 is connected with vcc the second pin is for ground and the third pin is for taking output now we need to design initial circuit of in infrared remote control circuit on the breadboard the output is taken from this rectifier circuit the first horizontal line is taken as VCC and the second horizontal line is taken as ground. Now this is TSOP IR sensor. The first pin of, of this sensor is connected with ground. Second pin is for supplying VCC and third pin is for taking output which is connected with the second pin of timer IC 555. The first pin of timer IC 555 is connected with ground. The second pin is for taking input which is given by the output of this TSOP sensor. The third pin is connected with the third pin of IC7474. The fourth pin is connected with VCC. The fifth pin is left open and sixth and seventh pin is being short circuited and a 220 kilo ohm resistance is connected with VCC and this short circuited terminal and a capacitance of 1 microfarad is connected with short circuited terminal and to ground. Now 7474 IC. This is a D flip flop IC. The first terminal of this 7474 IC is connected with VCC. The second pin is connected with sixth pin of of IC 7474. The third pin is connected with the third pin of timer IC 555 which is using a clock pulse generate generating a clock pulse. The fifth pin is connected is taken as output which is connected with a 100 ohm resistance and then to a transistor BC187. Now the 7th pin is connected with ground and the 14th pin number is connected with VCC. Now BC187 transistor. The middle terminal is for base and the 3rd pin is for emitter which is connected with the ground and the second base is connected with this 100 ohm resistance which is connected with pin number 5 of IC7474 the pin the first pin which is collector 
which is for taking output which is connected to this relay and a, a VCC is supplied to this from this horizontal line a diode is connected in parallel with this which is for protection of this relay this is for supplying the main from the AC which is supplying main for AC and this is normally closed point and this is normally open point we, we connect the live wire to this terminal and we take output from this terminal before integrating whole this circuit in the compact box the most important thing is that how this circuit means the infrared remote control circuit works here this is the TSOP IR sensor which receives IR signal from such type of remote the signal is given to this remote which is sensed by this sensor it generally works at 5 volt DC and the output is given to this timer IC triple five at the time of receiving signal it reaches to zero zero volt and then approaches to five volt and which is connected to the pin number two of triple five IC the triple five IC that is timer IC which is used in the circuit as a clock pulse generator to the D flip flop IC that which is IC 7474 the IC 7474 has two outputs Q and Q dash the Q terminal is pin number 5 which is connected with 100 ohm resistance and then with the base of the BC 187 transistor and then emitter is grounded and output is taken to the relay Have it integrated hold the circuit in this compact box here you can see that this is rectifier circuit this is clock pulse generated timer IC triple five this is IC 7474 and this is 6 volt relay and this is 6 volt step down transformer now the input is given from this wire and the output is being taken from this terminal this terminal is connected with live wire and this is connected with neutral and the earth is being connected directly from this wire this is the IR sensor TSOP IR sensor and a LED is added to this circuit which indicates that the circuit is at running condition or at off condition it is connected with pin number 5 of IC7474 and the other terminal of this LED is connected with ground now we are going to see that how does this works we are going to charge these cell phones by using this circuit infrared remote control circuit here the supply is given to from this wire from this board the board is at on condition we have to take output to this charger by using by giving signal from this remote now see the cell phone is charging Now we can control any electrical device by using this circuit such as fan, bulb and etc. Now we are going to lighten up this bulb by using this infrared remote control circuit. Here the circuit is at on condition. We have to just take out to this bulb by using this circuit. Now I am switching on the circuit. Thank you.
Hi, Neil Kumar Dubey. Thank you for watching this video. If you have any comment as well as suggestion, you can write it in comment box. If you like this video, please give a like to it. Thank you.